Greetings from MRH off MRH Get These Services. We live in the set. Getting her done. One more again. Lecture hall application. 102. Professor MRH live lifting 500 pound weights. PowerPoint presentation. Perfect for um, perfect physique. Live on stage, coming to the stage. MRS off MRS Gifty Services. Heavy bag sway. We get it done. Live lecture hall, lecture two. Program 103. Twelve hundred, five hundred pounds. Weights we be lifting, long distance. PowerPoint presentation. Get y'all there as we get her done. As we like to say, 
So we took y'all through the initial expelling of McKinley Rainer Helen off initially. MRH. We did that in 96. Coming out of FWHF. Administratively. It is now official, documented, lecture hall, lecture tube form, written out there on the range by LRS off MRS get to service. We do acknowledge the parental planning, parental consent of this matter. Because of course, visiting the grounds with the expelled volcanic activity of McKinley Rainier Highlands. And while visiting the grounds with the young son in order getting her done. It's now all coming to fruition. Now, as you have a chance to see it in its application, lecture hall, lecture two form. That means the adventurous day we set off to the great northwest mountain sketch. Of course, full adventure having fun. Four by four. Getting it done. Such an accomplished day. Of course, get it back to, to the forefront as the final frontier. Parental planning. Making it happen. Live in the set. PowerPoint presentation. So back. Just here. We had a uh, lecture hall. Lecture two, four, PowerPoint presentation, excerpt. We even give you all some time. Write down and jot down some notes. Check out the perfect form of the heavy bag sweat. No, bag moving side to side, up and down, front and backwards. Full range of motion. We consider this in its lecture hall, lecture form, in the consideration of also overcoming the 2001 earthquake by walking in front of the mirror in the hall. Now walking in front of the mirror simultaneously as the earthquake happened, MRH just so happened to be walking in front of it. Of course, Natural reaction. Getting to the front room, of course, to see exactly what's going on. Or what is considered the living room to see what's going on. So, for doing so in the hall, lecture hall, lecture two form, we raise above the fault, the guilt, the injury of the name of the end of the world which is earthquake basically entering the year 2000. This is 2001, February 28, 6.8 on the Richter. Shook the whole Northwest up. So, with that being said, reflecting off the mirror, walking through it, into the ceiling sky window, out into the atmosphere. So, the full truth of the matter and reality as it was taking place, as you very well know, something official like an earthquake, whole earth is moving, and you get to move quickly and fastly, you know, to get into position. I just so happened was walking straight forward toward the living room, mirror didn't fall, break, and 
flipped it off of it into the ceiling sky window out to the atmosphere. Raise above the fault, the debt, the guilt, and the injury of the name of the end of the whole world. Collectively speaking. In that passage, of course, touring to the northwest site with McKinley Rainier, Helen's already expelled. And full child support and ability, you know, to make it happen. For the year 2000. And doing so through that process, the adventures took place. That's more considered legendary, maybe even mythological, as harder to believe and have to be considered myth in this process of evolution, of course, time and position, and taking place. But it shouldn't be any more different than trying hard to see if this is 400 pounds and I'm really moving in the heavy bag. Sweat or not. So if it's hard to believe and it falls under to the myth category or phenomenon, that is fine. But this is the real deal. Taking it into pure consideration, this is the truth. The whole truth. In the matter of who is important, keeping things in order in a civilized manner. Taxable and retaxable. To have, you know, complete assurance. So, of course, the process of advancing medicine. Civilization, technology, all that took place. So get into those five key components of reality. You have to have the complete knowledge base and understanding of, you know, written off it on the range or MRH, already set in place in order. And being established in full support eternally. So as you very well know, those mountain ranges, grounds and lands, of course, the mountains have been around trillions, millions, and billions of times. As far as years are concerned. So, you know, to expel them holds its value. Coming to a new millennia, time change, and the full order of compliance. We took you through, of course, the fall of the of the Empire of Rome, early 753 BC, of course, one year 1000 AD, 1066 AD, getting into the unteenth and uh, of course single digit year of 112, 100, 1300, 1400 AD after the fall of the Roman Empire. Augustus is okay ideas and how they fell to the uh been violent barbaric beings. So getting into finding America coming out of the wrong stink sin has also fallen out of the Roman Empire, all took place and how America was discovered. So you have that, of course, in the history books. All right, you can get into the particulars of it. That's cool, that's fine. We just address it here as rediscovering America, non volcanically, through the paternity case, keeping these women nice, calm. Cool, relax, but still have enough, you know, up go tempo to understand that all the civilized reactions and considerations are all in place. His brothers know how to handle things, and that's just what we do. So, when we chop up gang, 
here in the live lecture hall, lecture, lecture two, we address it. But because we're dealing with uh, monumental pieces to most, or mythology in its exactation, we like to be as careful as possible, of course, with the full explanation. So we lift the full high, heavy bag, getting it done. Because realistic, it's a max weight. We do it long distance, we do keep this commentary. So if there is a listen, it is realistic when just naturally building, coming into consistency, finding the durations of time, and having the importance of reality. Now, with that being said, this also in its lecture hall, lecture two value is a full range of motion left. Just like the Earth is 360 degrees round. The speed of light is 617 million miles per hour. It's 7.5 times around the globe in one second. And we hit our goals as tachyons. That means it's faster than the speed of light moves. It means being faster than light moving 617 million miles per hour, 7.5 times around the globe in one second. When we hit these goals, we establish them, as you very well know, you tell, expelling the McKinley Rainier House. Falling into the paternal order, of course, Adventure days, having fun on the grounds and stuff. You know, exploring the wildlife, doing all that good stuff. Just absorbing nature and the good fun and essence. For by camping, all that stuff. Makes it good, but in its value, as you see it being lecture hall, and we're hitting weights in lecture two, and its whole consistency, its ecology, it is holistic Olympic views. And these holistic Olympic views, these are whole parts to the value. And these are whole parts to the order. So these aren't compliments where it's a niche in an instance of what you're looking for. And this is being that we took care of the whole shebang. You know, rounds have been around days and billions of trillions of years before, as we know it, existing with God before the creation of Earth. So as Earth was discovered and everything was created and thought of God, it became, of course, educational. It was AD and BC timelines. We just so happened to AC and BC at its most discretion realistic point, which is the highest peaks, triangles in Earth, describe where Earth is through its earthquake stage as being holistic earth is whole as it is raised above its fault its death its guilt and its injury so the matters are addressed consistently so as we have the lecture hall we have the lecture two we have the holistic point of view or the holistic reality that's just how things work. That's how it all took place. So, getting through that majestic order, everything else, of course, turned out exceptionally 
profoundly correct. We were able to go ahead and get into, of course, some of our almost comprised realities. So we jumped into the northern lights around the Alaska night skylines, just an origination of native and birthplace, and discovered them non volcanically. That's one of the, what they call, in an example, of the seven wonders of the world, the ten wonders of the world. We jumped into that non volcanically and addressed some of the, the major fixtures you know, that can't be explained non volcanically. It gave, you know, reference points to keeping the go, keeping it moving, rediscovering or originally discovering, you know, non biohazardous, non toxic, non poisonous, non drug infested. Margins of existence. So, with the expelling of McKinley Rainer Hellas, McKinley being the highest in Denali Park, where I'm originally from, without concern, the well magistrate addresses the end of trigonometry. What that means is finding the square root of x. Applying it in word, which is expel. Seeing it in its value, which is the highest triangle shape in Earth that is explosively nuclear in its reaction. Timing and base. And through substances just as volatile as an earthquake, or if not the cause of earthquakes. So getting into those particulars, these aren't evidence-based conjunctions. These aren't proofs that are considered for someone else's theory to be reconciled. This is, it is what it is. In Earth moves, you know. So having the correct serum you know thought process and of course prayers and in the goodness of the most high good lord leading us consistently we continue to reach these goals hear about it now or fervently understand the tachyon mechanism of being faster than the speed of light, which means these things, these goals were tackled in its most nuclear state of either erupting or being the cause of eruption throughout its dialogue and process. We do it long distance heavy bag weightlifting. Calm, cool, and collected. Whereas in most part, you would normally be out of breath, tired, can't go. And at a standstill, it's about your own values of, because you know, if I'll hunt for about 10 minutes, I'm good to go. You know what I'm saying? So if we show you the orchestration, the tachyon. Why time traveling is consistent with being faster than the speed of light and moving. Now, you know, doing this left, the way it looks, the way it feels, if you ever tried it, after about five, ten minutes, you'd have broken sweat, tired, and ready to go. Because you can't go no more at around 400 pounds. So, the tachyon movement. Not roughly, but clearly described what the wheels would be like. 
or what the jumping ability would be like, or you know, what the manifesto destiny would be like in its entirety. Naturally, by his movement, full range of motion of mankind at a cool max weight and a power clean state is at a long distance ratio. So, to grasp that essence, you might have to understand, instead of putting it into motion, we have it into tacking, which is time traveling. So it would be moving so fast against an opponent, you would make them look as if they are standing still. Or better yet, clear reference. That's what this lift will do. So I keep doing this lift, staying shit. That's what this lift would do in competition stay. But if I have a skill or a trade, I'm nice in some sort of building. Uh, commune and the origination of engineering, this would be the exact in getting it done. So it would consist within its order, its range of motion, and range in particular is faster than the speed of light at 617 million miles per hour. 7.5 times around the Earth in one second. So the tachyon time travel in the theorist's conveyance actually happens, really takes place. In order of a paternal matter, it really works. That means it's really happening. That means this isn't evidence or proof. This is what's really going on. So dealing with the time travel, coming out of theory, and knowing where it actually is applied and can work, is in the paternal graphic movement of reality. So we show you the adjustments made. And finally, the complete consistency of the tachyon Movement. So again, we're not testing this, meaning we're not trying to prove this. This is just naturally just happening. This is where it's naturally just sensible. This is the day and age of what it was thought to be and living in the year 2000, the new millennium, what was to come in flying car age to. You know, laser stream, uh, precisions, and you know, digital communications, all of those types of things. The uprise of technology. So, we did it pretty much correctly. So, you get the physical application of what it would be like, what this lift would produce at 400 pounds long distance ratio in competition, in a sporting arena or jogging, and you get its components realities of where it comes from, just from building, staying true freshman and ball. So staying and getting to its tachyon state, of course it has its privacy and confidentiality realities. We went through that process already. The speed of light has been evident through its most profound fixture to sound like, and making a consistent, beautiful move for the woman to raise the child in fully in order and put in order by the father at here, Michael and Harry. And this is how we do. How we get down in the young print state. 
in the manner of serving leadership. So we have the applicable jargon. We have the distinct long distance application of reality and conversation. Isn't it as a meditative interjection of not being confused? Getting into, you know, what's going on today. So when I say, you know, all that is working, all that is happening. I mean, that's only working and happening here, or is it working and happening there? So we have what is called the complacement of time and energy, where it is spent on an educational course to be accredited. Lecture hall, lecture two. So boom, we walk through the hall, bounce off the mirror during the quake, into the ceiling skylight. We didn't raise above the fault of death, the guilt, and injury of the name of the end of the world for the earthquake. 2001, 6.8, February 28th. Tachyon speed. Faster than the speed of light. So, in its consistency of ratio, Something closer to the year 2000, the millennium, and it being the relation of Earth moving, its most disastrous component to reality. It's realistic. We did tachyon speed. So we did time travel past the speed of light to tachyon speed, which is time travel in its existence around Earth in a matter that would be consistent to do so. The actual Earth. Where you can, uh, it would make sense if it was an earthquake or a natural disaster. And those abilities had to be explained. But where they actually happen and where they come from, because it is a paternal, paternal case, it is inexact. Meaning private confidentiality. As we know, this really works. This is really happening. So, Getting through the he say, she say processes and, you know, being available in the fathering state. This is what we apply as a science is manifested into the truth and kept it moving. So we'd like to thank you for viewing MRH and Flipmarch Gifting Services, Lecture Hall, Lecture 2, Session 103, Getting It Done. Check back with us for the next class note, PowerPoint presentation, written out on the rain from MRH of MRH Gifty Services. Getting it done. You know how we do what it is, right? Live up in the set. Get this heavy bag jump off. Ah, 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 